guys what is going on it is obadiah and today we are back playing some osiris and oh crap we're stuck oh god what did we do already i think we just broke the game uh i guess we can use this force kill option oh sure can so we glitched straight through the roof so don't try to do that <laughs> i started to just jet pack up and went straight through the roof and it did not work i'm dead would i like to continue of course i would um so that was the most fantastic thing ever let's see if we can get our stuff Ooh. yes take all Ugh. get out of here Ugh. okay so i recommend i do that is that my robot he survived how did he get back here does he have the stuff that I got? No. Okay, so he must be a new robot. He doesn't have the stuff I left in his inventory. But that's great. We have a new, we have our guy back. That's awesome. So today, what I think we want to do... Hey, can you come with me? Yeah. What I think uh, I want to do is make a couple more barrels. We need to get some hydrogen. And we need to get some rubber. And we need to get some carbon. And here's why. Let's go through here. Yes, airlock it up. Um, because carbon and hydrogen will give us plastic. And so we want to get some of that. What does this stuff do? Glass container with water. Glass container with hydrazine. Okay. Hydrochloric acid. So we can make all sorts of stuff. But we need to, so we need to make more barrels to capture this gas. We still have two, but in the last one, if you recall, we lost our uh, two that we, two of our barrels that we'd actually already filled. So I want to go ahead and make some more barrels. And I want to make some more assault rifle magazines because the last time we ran out and we ended up dying. So we need some titanium. Let's take the steel. Let's take some titanium. What else was it? I'm just going to guess. Aluminum, magnesium, lead, copper. Sure, yeah, we need it all. Okay. And let's just... Oh, wait, no. We want this in here. Open forge. So make the barrels. We need more steel. There we go, there's 10 more steel. Now we should be able to do at least two more barrels. And for these, we need more steel. Not enough minerals, what are we missing? Iron. Uh, 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 do we have any more? Oh, we sure do have more iron. So last time I think I made the mistake of only bringing two magazines. Um, and let's see, what do we got this time? Let's do, uh, uh, uh. So there's two. Is that enough to make another one? No. What are we out of? Magnesium. We definitely got some more of that. Magnesium. I've been hoarding that stuff because uh, I know I need it to make steel, which is pretty much used for everything. And now we should be able to make two more. And I think we're going to do one more if we can. We need six more of these. One, two, three, four, five, six. Take that. Make one of those. Take that. Awesome. Now we can go ahead and put all this stuff away. And stack all these up. Wait, I thought we just made two more barrels. Did we not take them for some reason? Or did we lose our current barrels? Where'd those barrels go? I thought we had two in our inventory and we just made two more. Apparently we did not do that. So what do we need? Copper and steel. Okay. Copper, we can grab. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and make these up and uh, then I'll bring you guys back and we go find some stuff. All right, we are coming across this little crater here, which is where we found the hydrogen and carbon before, both of which we definitely need. And look, there it is. It's not an alien, is it? No, it's not. Okay, it's starting to rain. So we definitely wanna get all the carbon we can and we wanna fill up these barrels because we're gonna need this stuff. And we can put on our robot to carry back if he ever catches up. Um, so this will help us make plastic, which I kind of like, I think is like the next step kind of. Uh, we gotta make sure to get all of it. I feel like we're gonna need more than what's just here, for sure. And I guess we'll fill up all of the, 
all everything all the barrels we got so we ended up finding those other two that we had made they were lower in our inventory come on get it okay so yeah you can oh oh what was that <coughs> the hydrogen just ignite well that's awesome and dangerous okay so let's do here and here and here so fill up four of them so hydrogen geyser fill up fill up there it goes okay fill up another one do they get heavier when you fill them up i wonder let's see our we're currently encumbered at 112 percent let's see if that goes up at all nope doesn't look like it all right, and once we have these all full, we can now go ahead and throw them. Oh, uh, 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 uh. put that back, put that back, put that back, put that back. Go ahead and throw them on this sucker, which will unencumber us. So you can put them on the carbon too. And we'll have them follow us. Um, so I want to get, we, I think we have plenty of rubber. We might grab a bit more, but I'm gonna look around for some more carbon for sure. Cause I have a feeling we're gonna need more of that. Um, I'm a little worried because it looks like night's approaching and over in this area real close to here is where we had all the troubles the other day uh, over near the rubber trees which are over that way so I'm a little bit worried about it but I'm gonna go look around see what else we can find it looks like there's already a little more carbon over here okay there is some kind of resource up here I'm hoping that it's carbon um and more likely it's not oh what is it oh that might be just iron but there's a big old alien block in the way there's all sorts of stuff up here so we definitely want to see it it's, it's on the way to our base anyway and the aliens get a little close so i think we're just gonna have to take him out luckily it's only a young crab monster not like those old crab monsters of yesteryear but uh let's see oh, maybe we can just bypass him oh we just get super lucky oh no here he comes all right should we just take him out Probably, but I feel like once I do, all sorts of other bad guys are gonna show up. It seems to be how it goes. Let's kind of look around, see if there's anything that we absolutely have to take. And if not, I think we'll just try to avoid. Nope, screw it. Let's kill him. Change my mind. I was gonna say let's just avoid him, but you know what? This is a game for killing aliens, and we we need to learn not to be scared of these guys. So come on, bud. Come at me. So where is he? Of course, I'm regretting it because his health is not going down as fast as I would like. But, he, but he's going down. Oh, we got him. How are you doing, bud? You doing okay? We don't really need any more alien crab meat. There's lead. I'm guessing that's more lead. Lead. Uh, do we need lead? I feel like we don't need that much lead. So let's just get some from over here. All right. See, so now that we killed him, we can just kind of mine in peace, which is nice. Uh, we got lead and aluminum and iron i already have have picked up a little bit of aluminum on this trip and a little bit of plutonium so let's try for the lead i haven't i don't remember what we use lead for yet use lead you lead for yet yeah sure that's probably what you think okay so now we got 21 lead uh let's take these carbons and stack them up there we go all right, we're pretty much full on stuff, so we're gonna kind of head home. We already got some aluminum. I think we have plenty of iron back at the base. Yeah, the base is right there though. So since we're out here, yeah, we'll go ahead and fill up our inventory and then we're gonna go ahead and head back. All right, we are back at base and did we grab the hydrogen? We sure did, and the rubber and a little bit of carbon. Yes, air pressurized lock. It's kind of annoying that you have to do that every time. And so let's go ahead and look in the chemistry table and we need to make some plastic. It takes 75 to make one plastic? Oh. So out of all that, we got four plastic. Four. And we need 20 to make a barracks. Holy crap. Um, I really do want to make a barracks. We're gonna need to make many, many trips to do this, aren't we? Uh, we need 10 for a biodome. Two for a hallway, we can make a hallway, fantastic. Um, hallway to nowhere. Okay, what kind of utilities do we need? Okay, we need to make wire 
for that. Uh, we can make a beacon, which I don't think we really need. We can live without. A flag is unnecessary. A large gas tank, don't need yet. A marker, don't need yet. A satellite, don't need yet. Okay, furniture. We already got the chem table. Ooh, a fabricator, indoor crafting. Okay, so that sounds like something we need. Not that yet. The bed goes in the barracks. The climate controller, uh, not two or two. So there's all sorts of stuff. A computer desk. Oh, that's int oh, it's inside barracks. Inside barracks. A storage locker. So maybe we'll make up some storage lockers, and we'll make up the fabricator. Let's do. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and throw some of this stuff in here. Throw it all in there so we don't have to carry it. Great. And we're gonna go grab some more stuff. All right, we went ahead and gathered some stuff up, put some stuff together, and now we're going to make some stiff. First, I think we are going to make a fabricator. Bam. Wait. What? Oh, oh, it goes right in the middle. Is that the only place it can go? Well, that's cool. All right, we'll confirm and build that sucker up. I have a feeling we're going to need to make more steel. I think that's what we're going to be short on. Done. Awesome. What can we make inside this thing? Wire, circuit board, glass container, battery, dart gun. That's cool. Stun. Oh, and tame? Creatures? Interesting. An assault rifle. Okay, so there's that. Uh, what else did we want to make? It was the computer desk. Let's go ahead and make that sucker. Oh, you need a barracks. My bad. I thought we could build that here. Okay, so let's go through the list. Got it. Got it. Need wire. That's for barracks. That's for barracks. Circuit board. Barracks. Storage locker. I do want to build some of those. Barracks. So circuit boards and wires seem to be the next thing on our list. So those we both make in here. So what do those take? The wires take rubber, copper, and gold. Oh, that's no problem. And circuit board takes lithium. Ooh. Um, so I don't have any lithium. I don't have any diamonds for that. That's for liquids. Okay. So I think we are going to make... Is there anything that we just need the wire for? thought there was. No, we also need some lithium. Okay, so I guess we'll worry about storage mainly right now. Until we can get some lit hands on some lithium. Where the heck do we get that? Do we make that? I don't know. Okay. Well, I want to make some storage stuff. Maybe we'll use this side for storage. Um, I really just want to make the large ones, but I want to see what they both look like. So I'll make a small one first. Okay, so a bunch of crates. We'll put one of those right there. Because obviously you want to check out what everything looks like, right? And it gives us a little more variety too in how things look. Awesome. And what does a small one hold? Okay, kind of like a depository, maybe a little bit smaller. And then let's go ahead and make a large storage locker. Oh, uh, which looks way cooler. All right, so that right in right there. And done. How much does this hold? Not, maybe double, maybe not even double. Okay, so things are starting to come along. We start to have a little bit of a building here. I'm gonna have to, we're gonna have to look around for some lithium, keep an eye on that. Um, let me go and see what else we can do. All right, guys, I do think that is going to be it for today. We did a lot today, honestly. We got a, made ourselves a fabricator, some storage stuff. We got some, made some plastics for the first time. Um, definitely some, oh, it is nighttime. Oh, the nighttime is scary. Oh, we got our robot back, which is rad, though I don't really know how we got him back. Uh, we did. And uh, so we actually, we got quite a bit done. Uh, anyway, this guys, like I was saying, that is going to be it. If you did enjoy the video or if you learned something, let's go inside where it's safe. Uh, or if you did learn something, do me a favor and hit the thumbs up button. And of course, always feel free to subscribe if you haven't done so yet. I mean, why wouldn't you? And uh, you can also hit me up on all of the social medias, your Facebooks, your Twitters, your Instagrams, uh, even your Google Pluses, which nobody ever uses. Uh, and of course, I do have a new Patreon as well. Why did my lights just go out? That is terrifying. Oh, on the fabricator, lights go out for some reason. What? Do that again. That's really weird. 
Um, but anyways, guys, I really do appreciate you coming to hang out with me, and I will see you again next time.